Welp, I'm gonna see if I can take Ni Hao on a plane trip. She could really relax. What's this? What does this say? Come to a nice beach where you and your girlfriend slash friends can have a good time. We have games, booze, bingo, and then some. Please stop by and take a try. From, Bongo Bonk Beach. Oh heck yeah. This will be so fun. But, I can't just tell her. It has to be a surprise. Man I'm so bored. What to do today? He ni hao. Pack your bags, we are going on plane trip. Why? Just do it. Time to get started with my boring ass day. And where do you think you're going? I'm going to the none of your business shop. You aren't going anywhere. Do you know that there is a prisoner on the loose? Did you even watch the news? Not at all. Well, I know what I say won't make you stay. So just be careful. Whatever. Trust me babe. This will be fun. I already knew from the start that you remembered the day we met. But you don't know where the plane is taking us. Ha, huh, I guess you're right about that. It might take a while to get there. Like how long? Two hours just by driving to the airport. Two hours? Which one are we going to? And I know you said that in a funny way. Lala sorry. But this is the only airport I know. I'm not even playing. Look what you've done. What I've done? Really? I told you to get off, now you're pregnant. I told you to pull out quickly before you're not inside. You literally wouldn't get off me. Don't play with me today. Lies. Sure it is. Leo and Clementine? That's us. Let's hurry and get this done. Wait, why are you coming in there as well? I wanna see if I may have an STD. Now what seems to be the problem? I'm pregnant because my stupid boyfriend didn't pull out in time. Yeah, yeah, whatever. She was the one who wouldn't get off me. No one is buying your lies, babe. You have fun thinking that. Alright, alright. Everyone settle down. So, do you want an abortion? Well, I... Um... I really don't know. The baby didn't do anything wrong. It was our fault, so... I'm really thinking on this. Maybe it's best if he or she disappears. Are you sure? Yes. I don't know if this can change your mind but... I was once told by my mom is that if I were ever to get a girl pregnant by accident... I am to keep the baby. The baby did nothing wrong, as you said. And you're right but you do realize you brought life into the world right? And my mom told me that if it was an accident God let you two have that baby for a reason. He or she must have some type of purpose. So yeah, I'm just saying. Will you keep it yes or no? That story was so touching. Yes I will keep my baby. Thank you for convincing me. I'm happy we have people like you in the world. Don't mention it. I'm just a good person in heart. So, what's your problem? I think I may have an STD. Me and my girlfriend do it way too much. Like, all the time. Man, if only my uncle would stop caring about me. I'm fine, no nigga ain't gonna mess with me because I got the strap. But, where am I walking to again? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go to the train station today. I need to go visit other places. Does this thing even work? Who is there? Hey sexy. You miss me boo. Dear lord. What happened to you? You're so hot. And no I didn't miss you at all. Babe you know you love me. You know you can't resist me. Now come over here and get some. Or I'll just come over there. You look so cute up close. Look, I'm just going for a train ride okay? 
I'm going somewhere. Hey, can I come with you babe? Also, everyone was looking at me. They think I'm hot also. Fine you can come. But, you ain't my girlfriend. But you're my boo. No I'm not. Can you knock that off? No. Nope. Love you too much. Rats. Why am I stuck with the emo girl? Looks like the train is here. Let's go. So, where are we going? Go Amamed City. Are we going to a motel? Yes, why? You gotta taste good, I'll drink it all. I'm going to go change. I'll be right back. All right, babe. How do I look? You look very cute. What do you want to do first? I really don't know. I still got that surprise for you. We just got to drive to it, okay? Yeah. By the way, do you really think it was a good idea to leave our child with Boris? Trust me. She will be fine. Alright then. Is that your kid boss? Hi. That's my son's child if you must know. Yo man chill. What's with the attitude? I was just asking bro. What kind of security are you? You acting very sus right now. Speaking of sus. Wanna play among us? Whatever I guess. But before that. Boss. Are you really sure you want to bring the child with you to your secret base? She is only four so we won't have any problems. I bet she doesn't even know what car this is right now. I mean... If you say so. You remember those last guys who almost towed right? I didn't wanna take their life. So we have to keep them kidnapped until we erase their memory. Yeah. It would be bad to let them go. They were really interested in telling the world what illegal stuff we are doing. Can't let words spread. At least not yet. Well, I'm gonna host the game on Among Us. You join me. Alright, tell me the code. Okay, hold up. They really think I'm that dumb? I'll show them. You're the imposter. Really? What's your evidence? I saw you doing a fake task in Med Bay. You were not scanning at all. What? I literally just walked on the pad, and you called a meeting because of it. Save it for the judge imposter. <coughs> ha 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 ha. Everyone literally voted you out lol. That's what you get for assuming lol. You shut your stupid mouth. Everyone there is dumb. I know you're the imposter from the start. I already told you I wasn't bro. You just susing on me because I walked on the pad and didn't do anything for one second. Oh, I guess you were not the imposter. Boss it's time to put our iPhone 12 Pros away. I think we are here. About damn time. Yes. About time indeed. Well, we are here. Let's go inside. Hannah, hurry up. We're going inside. This place is so boring. There is literally nothing to do. Listen kid. Boris wasn't even supposed to bring you here. You only came because he can't leave a four-year-old at a house by themselves. Now you listen here. I'm more than capable of staying at home. Whatever you four-year-old brat. Boris. Come get your female dog. I'll show you who is a female dog. Just wait till we leave. Oh no. I'm so scared of a four-year-old girl. Ha 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 ha. Lol nope. Alright, where are those two guys I hid? You wanna talk more stuff?
You don't hit an agent. You started it. You were being annoying as hell. You were one ugly motherfucker. You burn my eyes. You are such a meanie winnie. Bitch that what makes the money. You should try being mean. I think I'm good you old prune. Stop fighting with her and help me find where those people are. Come your tits. I'm on the case. And this is the Goanimate City Diner. Looks good. Yeah. But all we need to do is order some food. There's a waitress over there that can help us. I'll go ask. Okay, baby boo. I don't like that name. And what would you like? I'd like two cheeseburgers for that fatty over there. Lol, is that your boyfriend over there? Why, yes it is. No, I'm not. Don't listen to him. He is just shy. I can tell. Anyway, what would you like? Just a salad. Trying to keep your body right for your man, I see. You know it. I'm gotta give it to him hard once we leave here. You go, girl. Twerk on his dick. Guys always like that shit. And he seems like the type to jerk off to twerking girls. I would have never think to do that. Thanks for the tip. And also, it's very easy to tell he is into that kind of shit. Do you got a boyfriend as well? Yup, his name is Boko. A kid who was frozen in ice for 365 years. But he was unfrozen by scientists. Wow. You gotta show him how it's like in bed, aren't you? Oh hell yeah. Anyway, I'll take pink lemonade with no ice. And for my boyfriend, he will just have lemonade with no ice. I got you. Man, I'm so hungry I could eat a house. Good thing I decided to come to Go Animate City as well. I love you little Bill. I guess I'm starting to feel some kind of feelings for you. So I... I love you. I remember you. Gross, you're that nasty old fucker who put your hands on me. I pushed you down because you were trying to kill everyone. Which I still haven't forgotten. As for you little Bill, you may be 19, but I don't want you to see, or kiss, Gwen ever again. You're not anyone important. Please go away. I thought we had this talk uncle. I don't care what kind of talk we had. This girl is dangerous, what if she goes crazy again and kidnaps you? Far from it. She just wants to fuck me and that's it. Can you leave us 19 year olds alone? Go read a book or something, don't old people love doing that? You boomer. Whatever. You better not hurt my son. Whatever. Just fuck off now. <laughs>